Well, oddly enough, I came across a car uh, in my street, the street that I live in. <laughs> Uh, I, love that. I I drove, you know, you know, for a period of about six weeks, his car wouldn't move, and um, and I sort of talked to, to my wife Grace about it, and he, she said, "Look, why don't you go ask and see what the story is?" So I did, and that was a young a young uh, young guy. He would have been very early twenties, right? And he said to me, oh, "I was wondering when you were going to show," and I looked at him, and I thought. What do you mean? He says, "Well, don't you, you've got a 48215, which I've seen you driving up and down the street." I said, "Yes, I do." He said, "Well, I thought you might come knocking on the door." So, um, so I asked him about the car. He said, "Look, I noticed the car's been hasn't moved. It's been stationary for quite a long time. Uh, are you planning to restore it or sell it?" And he said, "No, I am actually going to sell it." Right. Okay. So, um, so upon that, I uh, I asked him how much. It was a very small amount, actually. Well, it was. Thousand dollars, I think. Okay. For All right. It. Yeah. Um, and I said, "Yep, no worries." And um, so, uh, so I did the deal. What shape was it in? Okay, it had uh, had a one eight six with a yellow terra head in it. Um, the exhaust system had been changed over. It was on a uh, alternator system. Uh, the only thing they didn't do was it was still running the original radiator on the one eight six. So they hadn't cut the the, uh, the, the subframe, or the, and uh, which is a, a big thing. Yeah. Um, the petrol tank was gone. It, it's absolutely reeked of petrol on the inside. Um, and uh, look, essentially, uh, I managed to roll it home. Right. Okay. Uh, fortunately, it was downhill to my to our house. Yeah. And uh, and I virtually rolled it home. And uh, so um, body wise, it wasn't too bad. Um, it was it was pretty good actually. Um, if it was a if it was if it needed the same amount of work as I put into the forty eight two one five, I I probably would have sold it straight away. Right. Okay. Um, yeah. But I yeah I you know I knew the car was was uh, pretty good shape. Yeah. Um, so uh, the floor pants were gone. A um, bit of rust in the um, in the guards, but the seals were good. The doors were good. The tailgate was good. Right. Um, what I did change was um, I bought a, uh, a petrol tank for it, yeah. which aren't easy to find because the wagons are different to the sedans. Okay. Uh, the uh, the filler is on the side, and on the sedan it's at the, uh, at the back under the boot right. catch. Um, I sourced the motor for it, a grey motor, uh, and put it all back to uh, to stock. So three on the tree. Three on the tree. Uh, it had its original plates on it. Yeah. I've got the plates on retention, um, but it's on club place at the moment. Yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, what are they like to work on to, to rebuild something like this? Well, they look they're simple cars in many respects, but um, like you know, um, it, once you start taking a car apart, you realise how many components are out to a car, even if it's a uh, you know, 67 year old car. Yeah. Um, I'd hate. I, I wouldn't even bother to try and do something like this to a, to a modern car, just uh, um, it would be beyond me. Um, but it, look, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I did most of the, I took the, did most of the body assembly, I took it apart put, and uh, had it painted, did all the uh, all the assembly, the grill, the, the, the glass, the, the door handles, um, and uh, yeah, it, it, uh, um, as simple as they are, uh, there's a lot of work. I'm sure there is. Um, what's, what are parts like for them? Parts weren't too bad. Um, I think that the biggest part, the, the most difficult thing for me was the tank. Right. Because uh, the only place I could find a tank was either, either another station sedan or a, a ute. Okay. Or a power yeah. van. Yeah. Um, and that was really hard. It was really hard to find ones. What's it like to drive? A uh, significant improvement on the 48215. Oh, is that right? Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, the um, the handling is, is much better. Um, I find it's got a bit more power as well. I think there's a slight, there's a slight variation in, in the grays, um, and it just yeah. Look, it, it's um, I quite enjoy driving. I really enjoy driving.